Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today we're talking about the release date of the new iOS 26.1. Now, as you probably know by now, iOS 26.1 is currently on its first beta and it has been on this first beta for like nine days now and it looks like we won't be getting a second beta this week. As expected, Apple usually tends to actually go on a two week schedule when it comes to releasing the first and then the second beta. But when can we expect this update to be released to the public? So let's go ahead, dive into this, take a look at what history says and when to expect iOS 26.1 to come out to the public. So the new iOS 26.1 will come with a lot of improvements and a few new features and changes which are actually super cool. If you want to see those cool new features, make sure you check out the card. You will have a video there with some of the best new features of the new iOS 26.1. But when can we expect this update to be released to the public? Well, taking a look back here at history, we can see the dates that Apple did release the point one updates for the last three years. 18.1 was October 28th, 17.1 October 25th, and then October 24th for 16.1. So as you can see, all of these have been released in the end of October. And that's what I think will happen this year. Now, of course, today is the 1st of October and there is not a lot of time for a lot of betas to be released, especially if Apple doesn't release a second beta this week. But if we take a look at history right here, you can see 18.1 had actually a lot of betas. Seven betas have been released for 18.1, but this was a bit different because as you probably know, it started on its beta since summer before even it before iOS 18 was even released to the public. But taking a look here previously at 17.1, we can see that it had only three betas. And that's what I'm expecting to happen this year as well. So taking a look at the calendar right here, we're on the 1st of October. And if Apple most likely doesn't release beta this week, then it will be the second beta on the 6th of October, which will be this upcoming Monday followed with the second and of course then with the third actual beta which will be October the 13th or the 14th one of those dates and then of course as usually before releasing the update to the public they will release an RC version. Now in my opinion taking a look at a history and everything that's happening I'm expecting the 20th of October to be the day that Apple releases the release candidate and then the final release should happen on October 27th. In my opinion, that's the date when we're getting this update released to the public. Because as you know, Apple will actually release another big update to iOS 26, just like it has done with the last few years with the last update. So 26.2 should come this year as well. And usually this will be an update that will contain a lot more new features. So that should then go on beta start of November, go through the November with the betas and then most likely be released some here, somewhere here around the middle towards the end of December, of course, before the holidays always point to updates get released before the holidays. So that's what should happen this year as well. So again, October 27th should be the day that you should expect iOS 26.1 to be released for your device. So that is it. Thank you guys for watching the video. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. Of course, subscribe for more. I'll see you on the next one.